What's going on, YouTube? So today, I figured I'd show y'all the routine when I let the chickens out on the pasture. So let's get started. Ladies! Before we let them out, let's go ahead and grab some eggs. Ladies! How many eggs y'all let me this morning? So we got five out of milk crate. Let's see how many's in the nest drop. So we got 14 eggs, that ain't too bad. So we're gonna go ahead and let the birds out, and I figured I'd show y'all how I do that. So when you do uh, the same thing every day, it's like moving animals or pasture. They get used to being moved. So I'm gonna open this door, and they just gonna go right in here. Let's grab this. There's a few chickens down here. We're gonna go ahead and turn on the electric. But most everybody's way up there where all the grass is. I decided to come up here on the top of the hill and show y'all the birds. Everybody's enjoying the grass that got mowed down. The grass has gotten a little high up here and dad mowed it. So they're, they're enjoying that little grass. But they don't have a good time out here today. I'll check on them periodically. But uh, yeah, we'll leave them out here until about 4 o'clock. Alright guys, it's a little later on in the evening. Like I said, it's about 4 o'clock. We're gonna go ahead and put the birds in. Why are you out in the yard? So as you see right here, everybody's ready. Everybody didn't get out on their own. That's what happens when you do the same thing over and over. They get used to a routine. Here's how I get everybody in. Well, sometimes it works better than the others. Everything's harder when you got the camera. That did not go as smooth as it should have. But when you're working with animals, it, it, that's how it goes sometimes. So we got everybody in, I believe. I'm gonna go ahead and look around the yard and make sure ain't nobody still out. But I believe everybody's in there. Thought I'd check see if there's any eggs since there was some chickens in here most of the day. So I did get three more eggs out of the deal. That makes about 17 for the day. That ain't too bad for about 23 chickens.
I get the other three bowls in and they'll be good to go for tonight. Everybody's in. Everybody's eating. So I think we're good. So one thing I did, and I'll show y'all here in a second. I turned off the water that goes to this bowl down here because it's real dirty. And I figured tomorrow morning, after they drank all this water, I'll clean out the bowl for them. This system here with the water works really good. You see they sticking their head through slits, so uh, it stays relatively clean. But, because chickens do scratch, inevitably they throw stuff in here. So I do gotta clean it out every several days. No matter what kind of system you got or how fancy it is, still gotta clean it out every now and then, whether it's automated or not. So it's the next day. I'm not gonna show you the whole routine again. But I'm gonna give the chickens the country and we're gonna clean out the water bowl. So as you can see, it went down, but there's a bunch of brown stuff in there. What that is actually is when the chickens eat their food, they get the grain on their beak, and when they dip it in the water, it comes off, and it all sinks down to the bottom. So we're gonna go ahead and clean it out. So I got the water out of the pan. I'm just going to go dump it out and rinse it out. All you gotta do now is turn it on. Alright y'all. If you enjoyed the video, hit like. Hit subscribe, hit the notification bell, and as always, we'll see you next time. Appreciate it.